please remember to subscribe and share. After years of broken promises to erect a statue of Sprint icon Usain Bolt in Water Square, Falmouth, work began on Monday morning. A notice from the municipality said, work to erect a base for the Usain Bolt statue will begin Monday. It will see a blocking of the areas for four months. At the last municipality meeting, CEO Wayne Palmer informed that materials for the construction of the base was purchased and the work to be done by JDF officers will begin shortly. Hyde Hall farmers have formed a group with the main aim of getting water to their farms. Alwyn Henry, speaking on behalf of the group, said, Our main focus is to get piped water from the wells in Clarkstown to our farms. When that is achieved, then we can look for other benefits. Meanwhile, the water from the well is coming out red and there has been a closure of the pumping of the water. Carlos Williams of National Irrigation Committee told Trelawney ILJ, We have some issues and those are being addressed and the pumping will resume shortly. Samos Gas. Are you looking for reliable gas distribution services? Look no further Samo Gas is here. We provide reliable and affordable gas distribution services to homes and businesses. We also offer competitive prices, free same-day delivery and free installation for all our customers. We provide high-quality gas for residential, commercial, and industrial applications. We have brands such as Petcom, Gaspro, and IGL. We are located at Carib Road, Martha Bray, Trelawney. Contact us today at 876-362995 or 876-610-5048 or 876-3195132 or 876-540-4383 or 876-265-4082 to learn more about our services and how we can help you. Samos Gas. On March 23rd, when a section of the ceiling in the resident magistrate court in Falmouth collapsed, activities of the court was moved to Duncan's. Since that time, checks have revealed more of the ceiling was compromised. That revelation has forced the closure of the upstairs section including the town hall. Mayor Colin Granger addressing the matter which now sees the meeting of the municipality now being held at the drop-in center said, termites have eaten almost most of the wooden area. It is no longer safe for us to meet there. Since 1926, no maintenance work has been done. It is going to take some time before any work will be done so that meeting once again can be held on the building. News just in. Holland High School scored gold in JCDC finals for a tambo dance in Kingston. Tambo dance is a dance of a romantic nature. Couples dance often involve a small percussion ensemble and in all versions, a female chorus. More information to follow.
Are you looking to increase your crop yields and improve the quality of your soil? Look no further than Organic Gold Fertilizer, the leading liquid fertilizer provider in Trelawney. Our products are specifically designed to improve soil health and increase crop yields in your gardens and farms. Our fertilizer is made with the highest quality ingredients and is guaranteed to provide exceptional results. Our product is environmentally friendly. Our expert team of agricultural professionals is always on hand to provide advice and assistance in helping you find the right fertilizer for your needs. Our fertilizer is also affordable and easy to apply. We offer a variety of application methods, including bulk, liquid, and granular. Our liquid fertilizer can be used as an insect repellent. We also provide custom application services to ensure that your fertilizer is applied optimally in your specific environment. Our commitment to quality, affordability, and customer service makes us the ideal choice for farmers, herbalists, and gardeners. Contact us today to learn more about how our fertilizer can help you maximize your crop yields. We are located in Low River, Trelawney. Call us at 876-443-2143. William Nimpa student Webster Bodden has proposed a walk trail from Falmouth to Matherbury. The proposal seems unlikely to materialize. The dumping of mangroves land along Market Street is acting against the walkway. Construction activities of what appears to be entrance and exit are now ongoing. Mayor of Falmouth, Colin Granger, has informed Trelawney ILJ that approval for the dumping has been given by NEPA, NEPA. We are not sure about approval for entrance and exit onto the main street. Stay tuned for more information as they unfold. Please remember to subscribe and share Trelawney ILJ News. This has been Trelawney LJ News. Please remember to subscribe and share. Have a wonderful day.